It's now possible to personalize Beatbot by using the Shell Designer program. This is built into both Lesson Activities 1 and 2. In the Shell Designer module, you can teach children about image manipulation and it's incredibly easy to use. We've supplied our own textures within the program. These are simply added by double clicking. That adds the image to the center drawing area. This can be loaded directly onto Beatbot. Or you can design your own textures, create mosaics, tile those onto the back of Beatbot, and Beatbot's colors can also be changed. This can be saved and then is applied to the Beatbot shell in the program. Because it's been saved, it now also shows up in the shell gallery. The shell gallery has a list of my Beatbots. These are ones that you've designed. It also has a set of Beatbot shells that are shipped with the program. These are pre-drawn and are there to give you ideas. We've made it great fun and easy to design your own textures for Beatbot. Go back to the Shell Designer module. Choose the Pattern Generator. Now we can generate a pattern. Add a new shape. Click and drag to change its shape. Left button changes the outline color right button fills it and we can increase the thickness of the lines by dragging here add another shape insert this one into the shape that you've already drawn and we'll give this one a different color let's add a third one go even smaller and then by dragging the mouse we can make a nice interesting pattern. That can be added to the Beatbot, either the pattern only or the pattern plus the background. Once we've got this shape, this can be added directly onto the Beatbot shell or we can tile it like we did previously. We can tile it as many times as you like and then add it to the Beatbot. I think it would be nice to change the beatbot's colour, so we'll change its head. And there's our new design. Save it, apply, and this has now been added. All the work that you do within the Shell Designer module can be turned into a practical activity. We can take textures that we've designed, adapt them, tile them if you want to. These can be added to the Beatbot, but to make this a practical activity, click print, and now you have a jacket that you can print out on an A4 piece of paper. It can be done in black and white and then coloured in, or it can be printed as a colour image as well. Cut them out, add them to the Beatbot, and you have a nice practical extension to your ICT activities. Once you've finished with your designs, it's quite a nice idea to save them to the program as well. So if we click on this button, you now see that any of the images that you've drawn within the program are saved for another time. It's easy to delete them if you don't wish to have them anymore. Simply click on the texture, right button click, delete the selected thumbnail, and that's gone from the program. Why not have a go and see what you can come up with?